The door latch is a little tricky. There's two latches. This is this latch is to the screen door. Now, if the, the main door is closed, you can't you can't open the, the screen door. I'm gonna leave this just like that. So to open the door to get out, you gotta pull on this knot, this um, latch like this. And sometimes, as you can see, when I'm trying to open the main door, this gets stuck. So you have to push down this lever and that, that releases both of them. Okay, so now you can actually open the door but if you want, if you want the um, the screen to go with the door, this is how you pull it shut. By the way, you, this handle right here, not this. Okay, this is going to unlock it. So you all you have to pull this and pull this back at the same time until it clicks, like that. Okay. So once again, when you're going out, you pull this lever right here. Push down on this lever, lever, whatever, and then it'll release both the screen door and the front door. Now, if you want them to be together, hold on to this lever right here, pull down on that, and then it catches right here, and then both the screen door and the main door open. Again, if you want to shut it, pull on this handle while opening this, pulling back on this, and then you hear it click. This locks the the door, okay? So on the outside, no one can open it. Now, when you're outside, just follow me outside. Me, I think I unlock it. Unlock, open that, and this time this stage uh, latch. That's good. When you come back out here. If you follow me down the ramp, <clears throat> when you are closing it you got to make sure sometimes it, it helps to pull on this latch so that way it'll close and then it'll click that's how you know that it's uh that it's latched because sometimes this thing gets ajar and then the cat can run out and of course then the door is open this opens it and usually both the screen door and the uh um the main door are, are together but sometimes this gets hot and you'll end up with something like that and the screen is there and the do main door is separated and that's okay if that's the case then all you do is push down this and then clip the two together and you can close the door and again this is how you know it's closed you got to pull this open make sure that it clicks and then it's that's done these lights over here will automatically come on. Alright, so mom's cold, she's going inside. These lights right here, the lights that go down along the, the bottom of the RV, and my bucket light automatically come on. There's a little timer right there. Okay, now at nighttime, if you want to go out and you want to have light, just kind of come over here and this bottom um, button right here says countdown okay if you want to run out and you and you want light you just hit this countdown and it'll run for 30 minutes on its own and it'll automatically turn off otherwise this light and the bucket light will come on by themselves around 5 p.m., which is what I have this set on, and it'll turn off at 10 p.m., okay? Of course, our cool ramp, the end. Love you, bye.